bum, ba, dum. Kept Melio alive like a champ. Good call by me. Now I just need to kill you to make sure I have a party bar to get her back up in case she goes down immediately after the chain attack. Which is why I'm going to sword drive here to make sure I kill. Nice. There we go. Don't block me. Aw, oh, times five poison. Goodbye, you're dead. It's been nice knowing you. Like, you may as... As soon as you get hit by Melia's times five poison, you may as well just stop existing. But it lost like a quarter of its health to, to one poison tick. That's insane. Thanks for the experience, nerd. Melia has a very nice health. Very nice villa. Anything up here? You know, I always hope that there will be a unique enemy or something. There are a lot of Errol Telethia. What the heck are they all doing here? Why are you nerds here? Really? None of you are a unique enemy? Really gonna hit me with the no unique enemy? I mean, I'm gonna kill you all now since I've come all this way. Alright, this is gonna build up a chain attack really fast. It actually did not do as much as I expected. It's fine. Spirit Breath will build up the party gods really fast because it'll be non-stop double attack crits. Alright. We do this. Really wish that had been an ice, but whatever. Do a Lariat here. Oh, I pressed it too early! The Tempest, the Soaring Tempest would have absolutely destroyed there. Very disappointing. Oh, you're dead as heck. Inspirational indeed. Alright, you gotta go, bud. Melia, you wanna throw out that chill, please? That'd do really good against these guys? Yeah, there we go. Nail him. You're dead. This one is as good as... No, not Soul Reed. Oh, it's fine. Soul Reed this nerd. That'll kill. Got him. Just go for a sword drive. Get a, get a kill, hopefully. Which we didn't, but... Really close. Got him. Oh, hey. Lariat at max power. Oh, there we go. Oh, I pressed B too late. I would have killed two with a worldly slash there. Oh, another chain attack, you say. I think I'll pass on this one. There we go. Anyone? I have so many Telethia rings. I don't have enough fingers to use all these rings. Anything up here? Nothing? I mean, like I said, I didn't expect to find anything here. I just wanted to check it out. It's a very nice villa. Very nice. Let's get on up out of here, then. Let's go to White Wing Palace and save Vidian and the other Hyentia that are there. That'll be another quest in the logbook. We still got about two hours in stream. We might be able to get down to, like, only the highest level quests being left over. We've done quite a few today, and we only had, like, 40, 45 left in the game when we started today. I feel like we finished probably about 15 to 20. Or maybe I'm overestimating. I don't know. I feel like I've done a lot. Because we had, we had, like, two quests that were just like, hey, need materials. And then I had the materials on me, so those were, like, instant done. I won't know for sure until after stream and I go through the spreadsheet and check stuff off. We're coming up on level 90, aren't we? By the way, I'm going to avoid all these enemies. Even if they see me, I'm just going to keep walking until I get to White Wing Palace. Because we can get out of combat by going into a teleporter. What level are we at? We're at 87. We're coming up on 90. I don't know what level enemies you fight for Ricky's fifth skill tree, but I know we get his skill tree in Machna Forest from the Nopon Sage. So we should probably go proc that mission and see if we can get it done. Getting Ricky's fifth skill tree would be very nice because he's one of the only three left. Wait, other side. I was looking the wrong way. This will take me to White Wing Palace. Sup, everyone? I'm here to save you. Let's get all of you refugees on up out of here. 
Oh, is it just? I thought that there were multiple people in my vision. Is it just Vidian here? Hi, Vidian. Hey. Thanks for helping us. I thought we were never going to get out of here. I guess it's just understood that there are more of them. There were two more of us here, but they've already fled. Oh, okay. They actually explained it. I still had some strength left, so I wanted to stay a little longer. The two who escaped are both really grateful to you all as well. I'd better get going now. I hope we meet again. I should probably, like, escort you out of here. Hey, quest complete. There's another one, Dan. That is a ton of... Ex that's almost 100,000 experience. That's what I need right there. That will get me a lot closer to uh, level 99. Can I hit level 90 now with expert mode? I bet I can. Yep. Perfect. I believe we are done messing around with Alchemoth now. Probably for the rest of the game. I think we're all finished. I need to drink. There might be another quest or two that is like, hey go get something in Alchemoth or go kill something in Alchemoth, but assuming no more quests like that come up, I believe we're all done with it now. Hello. I thought it would be impossible to obtain tidings of Vidian. I am so glad that all is well. I'm really grateful to you all for bringing me word of Vidian. Someone as decent as Vidian is destined to survive. Tis surely written in the stars. Hello. So it was fairly dangerous then? I was right not to go with you. Anyway, I'd have been no use. I'd merely have been in the way. Take this as a token of my thanks for your helping me. I am forever in your debt. It was nothing. Oh, stretch. Now we can go back to Alchemoth any time. I'm so happy. There's another quest done. Yeah, it's two quests back to back. You gotta be getting pretty close to being done with them all. Are those Sedna drones any good for Fiora? Oh, we got uh, new outfit stuff to look at. I'll look at that in a second. I do like the Loki drones. Oh, it's better. Sword Drones X. I've been wanting to try Sword Drones. It, Sword Drones was really good in that... Uh, it seemed really good in that thing I did. So yeah, let's let's switch to the Sedna drones. Why not? Boom, boom, boom. Sedna cowling. That's the one we just got. Ooh, that actually matches the Soloist cowling pretty darn well. I'll take that. I like it. The coloring is a tad off, but it, it works. And then everyone got a new shirt type, it seems like. Oh, the Orion Type 2. Okay. Ooh, Orion Type 2 actually looks pretty good on Sharla. But honestly, I just... I, I've kept it on her for most of the game. I just love the purple outfit. The Titan Type on her is so good. Orion Type 2 for Ricky. Yeah, it's like the Iron Man suit. Uh, for Dunman, it looks stupid because he's got a slinky on his arm. Ellie's Orion Type isn't too bad. Then Ryan... Oh my word. Not too bad. And lastly, Shulk. I think I hated your Orion type, didn't I? Oh no, it's actually alright. I think I hated like the Orion type legs or something like that. I can't remember. The chest plate looks good. But I mean like you can't you can't go wrong with super edgy Shulk, you know what I mean? I don't think I've used Shulk in battle at all today now that I think about it. Alright, that's all done. Still need to be a higher level for stuff with, like, the Falgar. A merciful end. We gotta go talk to the woman in Satoral Martian. That'll be done. Secret research. We do have to go through the Hyantia tomb and do some stuff. Uh, Oh, we actually only have, like, this is all of the active quests right now. We're getting close, chat. We're getting close to being done with them all. Slowly but surely. We do still need the Diamond Bra guy. You know what? Let's get that. Let's do that real quick. Where? I think someone said they spawn in Tephra Cave? Yep. It's gotta be in a new open area of Tephra Cave. So, fast travel me to Heavenly Window to start? We'll fight a movable Gonzalez today, don't worry. I'm not gonna do it right now, but we'll, we'll fight him. And hopefully beat him before today is over. I'll probably play as Shulk for that fight. Oh, the Brogs are like right back over here. This bonnet's gonna see me. Yep, I knew it. I need the Brog to drop at least a silver chest. So we are probably... Oh, the Brogs are like mixed in with all these spiders. That's annoying. Yeah, there it is right there. Young Brog. Level 95? 
I'm gonna want to fight the upper brog, I think, because it looks like it's it's got some bang near it, maybe, but it'll be away from all the spiders. I think all of these spiders will be more annoying. Oh, no, wait, is that a bunnet up there, too? I couldn't tell. Hold up. Let's find out. I gotta find a good spot to fight these things. Also, I definitely want Ricky in the party for this because I do not want to kill it and not get the item. That would be mad annoying. We for sure want to make sure we get the kill here. Or get the chest, I mean. So we don't have to worry about this anymore. Uh, no, there's not a bonnet around it. The Vangs might join, but it'll probably just be the Brog. So let's, let's get the Brog. Unless we fight, we cannot proceed. No. Come here. It looks promising. Don't worry, I got it. For a second, I thought Dunban had lost like half of his health in one hit, but then I realized, no, he had the HP up up at the start, and that's why that happened. Ricky, go ahead and give me your aggro, my dude. I got this. Don't you worry. Oh, I got the break. Get on the ground. I toppled him as he jumped at me. That's beautiful. Stay toppled forever. Oh, he's got a topple spike. Dang it. I hate that. Look at that beautiful damage, though. Uh, I don't think I have a Blossom Dance, so bitey bitey it is. Oh, yeah, it's like 1,700. Yeah, I was nowhere near a Blossom Dance. He takes a lot of... He does a lot of topple damage. Except to Dunban, because he doesn't believe in spikes anymore, which is great. Oh, the poison. You're dead. Goodbye. It's been nice knowing you. Suffer more. Burn. I did not think I would get another chain link. It's, it's still going, huh? It, it's still going. Like, die? Okay. It, chat? I'm running out of moves. That, we did it. Killed him with the chain link. And we got a silver chest, I think. It's no gold, but it's all I need. Diamond bra guy. He's done it. All right. So now we have all but one. Or we don't have it yet, but we're going to go get the fifth replica Monado. And we still need the fourth one. That's the last one. Have you ever heard of Spectrobe's Chaos? Yeah, I did a playthrough of all three Spectrobe games. I'm not really a big fan of the first Spectrobes or the second one. They're like okay games. But I really, really love Spectrobe's Origins. The one on the Wii. The two DS games were very meh. I might even say kind of bad. But the Spectrobe's Origins game on the Wii is like a hidden gem. It was very fun. But I did a playthrough of all three games that you can find on my channel. All of them are in a playlist. All right, Vinaya. Hello. Got another one for you. I see you've gathered the necessary materials. I will get to work immediately. Let's go. One more replica Monado to go. I have finished. The Monado Saga has been designed for superior defense. Worthless. Its thick materials suppress the blade output. Attack strength is greatly reduced, but it provides peerless defense. Literally worthless. Like, you should not have even bothered creating this Monado. Uh, it's only got two slots? Actual trash. This might be the worst replica Monado in the game. Yo, it looks pretty sick, though. It does look pretty cool. It gives a ton of defense. Like, it, it does give a lot. I'll give you that. But it's literally trash for Shulk's playstyle. Especially with only, why Why does the worst Monado, I guess because it's just too bulky, they're like, oh, it's so defensively good, we can't give it three slots on top of that. But like, who wants to run a defensive Shulk? This is actually terrible. I really should switch to the Monado Abyss, it's a better weapon. But they don't let me change, I really wish they'd let me change the appearance, because if I could keep the Monado Rudra look, I would switch to the Monado Abyss. But I just love the look of the Rudra. Alright, we've only got one more Replica Monado to go, right? Yeah, just Replica Monado 4. The Demonic Everflame and the Mammoth Horn. We still haven't invited those people, the Argentuses, over yet. Where is, uh... Where is Don Argentus? I can probably just look in the affinity chart instead of asking chat. Uh... Don Argentus, that would be counted as, like, Alchemoth, like, Upper Bionis area. Not N. Argentis. I have to... That's one of the sisters. There's, like, a father and two sisters. You have to invite the father first, I was told. Because I tried to invite one of the sisters, and it wouldn't let me. Oh, Don Argentis is, like, not on the list. Is he in Central Bionis somewhere? 
There's Zell Argentis. I'm pretty sure I get to invite either Zell or N Argentis, one or the other. But I have to invite Dawn first, I think. I don't know where he is. Is he in Colony 9? Where are you at, Don Argentis? Did I invite you to Colony 6, but then just forgot to invite your children? Is that what happened here? No? Am I losing my mind? Is he in the Hidden Village? Did I, did I scroll over his name and miss it? Chat, am I missing something? Because <laughs> you have to, and I was told, I tried to invite, not Zell Argentis, I tried to invite El Argentis or whatever her name was, and it was like, oh, it won't let me invite her. And chat was like, oh, you have to invite her dad first. Does he just not show up on the affinity chart? I'm Googling this. Where Where is Don Argentis? Xenoblade Don Argentis. You passed him on Upper Bionis, did I? Oh yeah, it says he's in Frontier Village. Did I just not see his name? I might just be blind. That's always a possibility. Argentis. Dude, he's not on this list. You know what? Maybe I've never talked to him. Maybe I've never talked to him and he's not registered. I guess that's possible. Because the Argentis that was on there was Zell Argentis. I need Don Argentis. But let's go check Frontier Village. It's possible I just never talked to him. So what time does he spawn? 18 to 6, Frontier Village, near the Reservoir. So that's down at the bottom area, which is easy to find. And it's actually his time to spawn right now. Perfect. Let's get Don Argentis, and then I'm going to invite whatever Argentis is at Satoral Marsh. I don't think it makes a huge difference either way, to be honest. It's still going to be the same idea of quests. All right, Reservoir would be out here. You were looking on Upper Bionis, but he's in Central now. When he show up on the Central one? I didn't think I saw him on this one. There's N Argentis on Upper Bionis. Yeah, he's not on this one either, chat. You're losing your mind. It doesn't show Don Argentis on any of them. Oh, that's him right there, I bet. There he is. What's up, Don? Did you hear the rumors about the wonderful Colony 6? People of any race are welcome. I'm thinking about moving there. You never know. They might need a high Intia representative. Get invited. Oh, you will not be disappointed. Leave all Colony 6 high Intia matters to me. Haha, -ha, here I come, Colony 6. Got him. Very nice. Wings of Nobility. Affinity chart updated. Check. Yep, I didn't have him on the thing at all until just now. I don't think. I don't know why. Why did I get the achievement Wings of Nobility? Can you, where do you check achievements in this game? Right here? Bonebreaker. Defeat more and more and more and more. <laughs> where is, where's the wing thing? I only, I'm only missing 29 records, apparently. Wipe out all Telethia in sight. Break innumerable vision tags. Probably whenever I do my NG+, plus, we'll probably unlock most of these, because I assume, like, the, the thing where it's, like, break a bunch of vision tags, which is what this is, it's probably, like, uh, it carries over to the next the next game. Battle start affinity into affinity. Where is... I want to see the wing thing. What, what caused that? I want to know. Do, 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 do. Where is it? I might have passed it by mistake. Because I am reading some of these as I go. Do crafting your destiny. Synergy bonus more than 500 times. Fever state three times. Nice. Fell to your demise from a great height. Making waves. One is never enough. Yada yada. Fill in the entire collectopedia. Better be thorough. Ah, nice. 
We won't be able to get that until after we beat the final Marcus, the first super boss. I love this. Give Ryan an energy. Aubergine is a gift. And then everyone else is like, give them 20. Give Dunban some fruit to try and sweeten him up. What? I'm going to do that. Had Melia give 30 gifts. Have Ricky give everyone else the thing he likes. That's hilarious. Love potion. That's the item. The love potion is an item you can't get without beating the super bosses. I, I don't even remember what I'm looking for anymore. It was something about wings. I probably passed it. Trade to get an angel engine Y. Trade to get a thunder compass. Oh, these are all of the, uh, the collectopedia things. Transact a titanic truckload of trades. 